que never. Why? Because when we say things, things are listening. Things are listening. They are ready to take orders from us. When it comes to prayer, most of you, I know you pray a lot, but the problem with you is that after prayer, you start saying contrary, opposite, negative things. What are you saying after prayer? You have prayed about your mountain. You have prayed about the tree. But what are you saying to the tree? What are you saying to the mountain? I used to be like that. I said it when I was giving some lessons before. I used to say, God, heal the sick. God, when I meet your people, whether that person is suffering from malaria, I'm asking your God. that when I lay my hands on those people, let them recover, God. Until the Holy Spirit started teaching me how to go about it. And he said, when you face a mountain, you don't pray to the mountain say to the mountain and when I enter into the place of prayer when I finish praying to God I start making some decrees and speaking to the mountains Malaria I come against you right now you cannot stand my presence I'm representing God in this situation I command you in the name of Jesus. Die. Before even meeting the person, by the time I meet with the person suffering from malaria, the person might be seeing me for the first time, but malaria we have met before. We have known each other. We have already made some introductions before. I'm not a new person. It will have to go. Faith for the impossible. Do you have that desire? Do you desire to be used by God? Is that your cry? Ah. You know, with me, I, I would spend days, I would spend weeks and months. I would not even allow myself to go to sleep without having to meditate first the greatness of God. Meditate upon the hand of God. What God can do. How God can bring a change through you. A change through you. Desire, desire, desire. Even Paul talks about desiring these spiritual gifts. All that you may prophesy. Certain people, when I finish doing what I do, whether healing the sick, whether prophesy, some they will go home, they will sleep. Some, they will spend hours thinking about it. Because there are certain people that are always there to challenge you every time. Because you look at certain people, you wonder how can they be seeing everything by themselves? And I can't see even a little thing. Not even once. And how you desire so much, it's more than what the person is doing. But you're asking yourself, what's wrong with me? What's wrong with me? What is it with me? And your prayer should be, Lord, open my eyes so that I can see, open my ears so I can hear. I want to be relevant in the spirit. Thank God for Peter. He remembered what had happened yesterday. 
if it was some of you, you would have forgotten that we passed through the same place and Jesus spoke some words into this tree. If it was some of you, you are not even spiritual enough. That's why you have certain people, you prophesy to them after the fulfillment of the prophecy, you have to remind them again that remember I prophesied to you. They will have forgotten already. Their spirits are dead. You can't be like that. You, you can't be like that. Because you know your God. And I pray that even before this year comes to an end, you will start doing some exploits. You will start doing some amazing things. 